excited to play a Game Boy Color game here. Yeah, we're gonna see how this is because uh, we're not sure. Yeah, I'm sure you're, nobody can tell what it is yet because it's not exactly uh, accurate, fair representation of Little Nicky, the movie with Adam Sandler. <laughs> It's like, that's not even, is that even like the font from the movie? I don't think it is. I don't think it is either. It's just something that looked metal. All right. You see, you got your ram skull with fangs. So first off, the first thing I noticed is you, you don't even look like Adam Sandler. Yeah, I mean, I see what they were going through, but or going for. Yeah, but... they were going through hell making this game. Oh. <laughs> My Sonic Metal. Now everyone, come sit down. I have something important to discuss. This, as some of you know, is my 10,000th year of Prince of Darkness. So I think the time has come to discuss who will succeed me. I just know it's gonna be me. Not me. Not me. <laughs> After much thought and consideration, the ruler be me. Classic. Hallelujah. I mean, that sucks. This is bull. <laughs> that guy didn't talk, so <laughs> you lack wisdom. Uh, is this Jesus. That's a slap in the face. Where can the we rule? What do you think about Earth? There's a lot of dialogue. We I know you can't skip own. it either. Wait, you can't skip this? Oh, oh man, it's so hard to read on this tiny screen. It's our time to brother. Let's go. You can't go through that. Out of our way. You guys suck. You really suck. Whoa, oh, the, those guys are fast. Those pixels. Oh, are you Here playing we, now? There yeah. we go. There we go. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> All you do is walk Adrian into a and really and Blah, blah, come blah. They'll come back to hell or yeah, not. We I've got, never been I've to seen the movie. Death. Jesus. I've never even slept ever. Maybe this is just the movie, but as a like a, a pixelated adventure, you know? It's just a pixelated animation. Oh, of the we can movie. only hope. Okay. Oh, there wait. We there we go. Looks, this looks like gameplay. Oh, oh my god. Thank god. <laughs> So you'll need to try and stay warm. Your you power think? depends on heat. <laughs> All right. So what? I have to collect jackets or some shit? Come on. Wait. Was that was that how it was in the movie? He didn't even say what I had to do, which is a little bit. You're gonna find out here. Chicken? Is that a burning chicken store that's smaller than you? Why? You couldn't get a chicken from that establishment. Oh. Um. Yeah. This looks really fun, Jacob. You're having... Is, are the controls decent? As Oh. As far as I can tell, there's only jump. Um. Which... Okay. Maybe all you need to do is jump. There's nowhere to even go. Go to the right. I think the wall's open. Oh. Uh. Yeah. It doesn't oh, look no. like it. It's all the same color. I guess they were limited with the Game Boy, but... We've set up to help you prepare for the Avoid the traffic. Got it. Got it, dude. I freaking got it, dude. Uh. Okay, you ducks. Don't. Man, don't. this is really scary. I feel like I'm in hell. Oh, I feel fuck. like I'm in hell too, sitting here watching this game. Oh, you can do this. Come on. This is for children. I doubt it's for children. Release the awesome. Reveal the good. Wait, those are types of things that little Nikki would say, right? I don't remember too much about the movie. I remember that Popeyes is awesome, and I remember them being like, Popeyes nope. chicken is the shiznit, right? Yeah. Yep. I don't even... I don't even know how I go up here. It's, you you gotta jump at the right timing. Jump at the right timing and don't get killed by that death car hanging from a conveyor belt. You're not you're jumping too early. You're jumping too early. You got you gotta go a little bit closer to the edge. There you Jesus. go. Jesus. Precision jumping here on I guess so. Game oh, Boy. Fuck. Right into the taxi. You can do this. Oh, oh wait, do you have to burn all the chicken uh, stores? Is that what it is? Because when you touch it it lights on fire? It was already on fire. The one up there was? Yeah. Oh, okay, never mind. Maybe they're just there for decoration because they're burning down. 
Now, wasn't Little Nicky like mostly in a city? Where, you, where even are we? It's Inside a simulation of, of Earth, because it's the Earth simulator. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah, that's what he was talking about. Oh, it's, oh so he can prepare to, to go down. Yeah, I'm still in hell. Go to the right. He go looks, to the right. Uh, it definitely looks like he's limping like Igor. You think that they'll ever make a, a song where that's the dance, limping like Igor? By Limp Biscuit? Yeah. Limping like Igor! Bringing potions to my savior! Who's his savior? Dr. Frankenstein! Yeah, because Igor was Dr. Frankenstein's uh, part uh, partner. Little Nicky's looking like Igor a little bit in his uh, like walk cycle in this game. Yeah, he, that's what I'm saying. He's also like really slow. He's, <laughs> is there any, can you hit like any other button to make you run like at the no. same time? No, it's just jumping. Man, that jumping is walk. a loud D-pad. <laughs> It really well it's because it's recording right next to the screen we're actually filming the screen with a, a video cam recorder very smoothly yeah, we're right above it's it's making it really hard to see the screen which is why Jacob's playing so poorly um, it that is why I'm oh the black part is part of the platform I thought that was is? like a shadow Oh, it is I a didn't shadow, know I could, but... I didn't know I could walk on that. It's a shadow, but this isn't a three-dimensional plane, so it doesn't work... The physics don't work the same as it would in real life. Why? Because they did a bad yeah. job with the art direction. That shadow didn't need to be there. Why did they need to try and make it look 3D? Nobody's expecting 3D. It was a Game Boy. This is insane. Like, there's no... Like, room for error in the jumping. I... That's how they got the, you know, they couldn't fit that much in the cartridges, so they made the jumping mechanic so poor that it would extend gameplay. Oh my god. Can I try this? I'm like, I was getting on it. Okay, hang on. He's handed me the Game Boy. There we go, okay. I'm gonna try. Man, this does suck. Oh, okay. Look, I'm gonna, gotta get a little bit closer than that. Alright, ready? Oh, gotta get. Oh, we're running out of time. No, this is bonkers all over again. <laughs> mm, no, 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 no. The time's almost up. The time's almost up. You can't get over this. I know, man. The jumping is, like, ridiculously hard. It's, you can't press the up. It's not like, it's not like Bugs Bunny. Ah, crap. Oh, <laughs> I'll have to take a model again on this one. Jesus. He sounds like a certain someone we know. Yeah. Alright, I don't... This game's pretty terrible. It doesn't remind me that... There was a huge cutscene about the movie. Sorry, I stole the controller. Did you want to... Uh, no, it's fine. I'm going to see if I can get up there again real fast. This is where it was right here, right? No. No? Well... Yeah, now nah, after this one. Wait, what's that thing? That thing that comes up on the side. Wait, so there's like a gauge filling up on the left. I have no idea. I didn't even notice that. Can I do something with that? You can, you can run with that. Oh, really? Oh, that's what it is. You need to fill up your. You need to fill up with Popeye's chicken in order to run, so you oh can beat the God. level. All right, they made it just like the movie. This wow. is the most accurate game I've ever played. This is so fast now. This is actually kind of difficult. Yeah, I, you want, I you want do to try want to try it, it again. There you go. Hopefully that's not the end. Yeah, so you got to power up at the chicken stand. Oh, fuck. See, the thing... See, this simulation Whoa. doesn't make sense because there would never be this many Popeyes right next to each other in a city. Damn it. It's too fast. Yeah, yeah it is. Like, it makes it just as hard when it's fast. Yes, 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 yes. Did you beat it? You made it out. You made it out of the simulation. I beat the simulation. All right, let's see what he says. This can't be happening. Yeah, you're right. Another cutscene. I I agree. And I hate that it makes you walk to the next cutscene. Nobody wants to do that. Stage, Stage one. one. Oh, that was just a down. Ah, oh, that was like one, the tutorial. Rats in the cellar. Okay. Rats in the cell, rats in the cellar. Fine. We could fry those up at Popeye's chicken and it'd be awesome. 
Okay, Earth. Oh, sweet oh, fire get... juice. Yeah, you want to charge up with that fire and then run way too Whoa! fast to be able to even dodge and. Why are there so many hazards on Earth? It's weird because you think, like, you intellectually you are like, oh, I need to avoid the fire. But you don't. You want to avoid everything but the fire. Yeah. <laughs> oh, did you just run over that gap without jumping? I don't know. I wonder if that... Wow. I'm going to have to take a mulligan. More like a shit again. <laughs> I'm going to have to give him the schnapp. He does kind of sound like Diggum. Uh, uh, hit... Select plus A to quit. No, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Just spits it out. Wait, was that guy talking about it? the... Is yeah. that the boob head guy? The guy with the two boobs on his head? He said something about that guy. Oh, okay. Stage one again. Second attempt. Get ready. I'm gonna burn myself before I start this episode. Uh, construction zone. Fuck, I hit the first one. Yeah, you just... Yeah, you want to dodge the fire, but... Is you... that health, like, that, or is it just, like, running? No, it's just running. Oh. Your health is completely different. Damn. Your health is on the bottom right, and it only pops up when you get hit, so you can't even use it to your advantage to know when you need to be careful. Fuck. <laughs> Why can't that health thing just stay on the... You made it... You made it... Th that was a dumb level. <laughs> <laughs> Stage two, watch out. Get ready. I guess they had to be simple, it's because it was a Game Boy. Oh, Let's be honest, they could have tried a little harder on this. They could have made it. They could have at least mo-capped Adam Sandler. <laughs> mo-cap Adam Sandler. Oh fuck! It didn't even give me more life when I started the the new level. Oh, All yeah. right, what? He's going bye byes. Oh yeah. Oh right, right. His dad was dying. Yeah, he was like disappearing. Yeah, you're gonna have to jump back into that fiery hole. Oh my god. Wee. I gotta read. Oh, okay. oh good. Stage one. Stage. I mean, stage two. Watch out, Watch for, out for that. Dot, dot, dot. Watch out for that tree. It's Watch George of the what? Jungle. <laughs> George, George, George of the Jungle. Friend to you and me. <laughs> oh! Watch out for that Popeye's chicken. Man, me and my sister loved George of the Jungle when we were little. Yeah, watch out for that tree, man. We. I don't know. Brendan Fraser was doing a good what job. What happened? Uh, I guess hit I by made a it. train? No, you got hit by a train. What? I think there's, there's there's parts in the ground you can fall into. Damn. I guess if you get you have to go into those when the train's coming, or you get hit by it. Anyway, what well, Brendan Fraser? Yeah, he was George of the Jungle. You and yeah. your sister. You, you did you watch that a lot? Oh yeah, we had that on VHS, and we watched it like fucking every week. I think like it was just a a hit in our household. Man, I just keep fucking jumping right into him. What? So there's a train. I, I think that hole at the beginning you have to stay in. Ah, oh, game over. Game over, man. God game damn. over. What was? There was a commercial I remember that said that. Game over, man. Game over. That's from <gasps> Aliens. Bill Paxton. Did it. <laughs> right. <laughs> Old Bill Paxton. Now, so over at Universal Studios, uh, they have this. They used to have this Twister show. Where they would go, like, make a fake tornado, and there'd be, like, oh, buildings yeah, lighting on fire. Yeah, I saw, I've been on that. And if you watch, now, you can't, unfortunately, you can't watch it anymore, because that, that ride's gone now, and I think it was replaced with, like, the Jimmy Fallon ride. Oh, Jesus The Jimmy Christ. Fallon ride. Who gives ride a fuck about York. Jimmy it's, Fallon? I've been on it. It's pretty sweet. It's better than you'll think, than you think it would be. I hate Jimmy Fallon. I would never even go on that. Um, but, <laughs> you're gonna hate on Jimmy Fallon. I, He's a I, fucking douchebag. Uh, where was I going with that? Oh. To hell. To hell. Oh, right. Uh, Jimmy Fallon. Oh, right. The, uh, the Twister. So Bill Paxton in the video was talking about the movie and how it was made. And then, like, the, every single time he comes onto the camera, you see him slowly, like, walk towards the screen and then cock his hip super far to the side and put his, his hand on it. Of course he did. He was just like, and he was just like, you ever seen a twister, kids? And then he's just, it's cocked like so far to the side, like, what's that, uh, uh um, what's that art term where, uh, it, it, it's, uh, when the characters are in a, a renaissance art, if characters are in a position to represent, or to, to show balance, or show weight on the characters, what's, what's that? Uh, like, contraposto. Contraposto, yeah, contraposto. 
Yeah, he's basically like, it's Bill Paxton in a contraposto, and he's just telling you about the Twisters, and it's the funniest thing. It's like, I always called that doing the Paxton after that. Yeah. Like, when you, when you copy it, when you cock your hip, so. I wouldn't call that the Paxton anymore, because, you know, he's not with us. Yeah, but we, got, we gotta let his legacy, we have to have his legacy live on. By cocking your hip out. Yeah, labeling doing the it as doing the Paxton. Yeah, nobody will ever forget his name. The cock hip. What a what a Bill Paxton honor to his memory. I know he was good. He was a good man. Part of a good show at Universal. Part of all of our hearts. Yeah, he played. Uh, I think his name's Coconut Pete on uh, <laughs> in that <laughs> Club Dread. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. My, uh, one of the parts I remember about that movie was um, where the the one guy, the what's his name in that movie is Farva. Um. Uh, that Farva that's guy. Kevin Heffernan. Kevin that's character. Uh, I don't. Fuck. What is his name? I don't know. He was like a hippie kind yeah, of. Yeah, he's guy. like a hippie. But there's this one part where like he does like a prayer to like make himself skinnier so he can fit under a bed. Oh yeah, he's trying not to get murdered. <laughs> he does like this weird prayer, and his stomach deflates, and he he's able to crawl under the bed and avoid getting seen. <laughs> it it's just I remember like his belly looks like a ah. deflating beach ball when it happens. Yeah, <laughs> like it's like so Good. obviously not. Yeah, it was a, a fu- stomach. It was like a funny practical effect though. I'm glad they did it like that. Yeah, it was a great practical effect. Get out of here. Bill Paxton would approve. He would hip cock to that anytime. And then there's a scene where they're like Pac-Man and they're running through the maze, but then two of them are oh, getting yeah. it on. It was like a grape and a... I don't remember much about that movie. I don't remember about the killer. There's some kind of a twist in there. Yeah. Well, everyone should go watch it anyways on their own. Yeah. yeah it's go a really watch, funny movie. Watch Club Dread. Watch all of the Broken Lizard movies. They're, they actually have way more than people think. Yeah. Is there any fire you can power up with anywhere? Uh, it's like way down here. I have to go all the way back. Uh, cause... I was gonna say, you may want to get some of that just so you can get through this a little easier. Those jumps looked a little difficult. Ah, oh, fuck. What, what, d- right? what other movies have they, they made? I know that they did Super Trooper. Yeah, they did Beer Fest. Uh, they did, uh... Wait, how did we get back to this again? Because... We got a game over. Oh. I just kept going because we were talking. Gotcha. Uh, they did Beer Fest. Oh, fuck. They did Super Troopers. They did Club Dread. They, yeah, they did uh, They did Super Troopers 2. Of Slam and Salmon. That's a good one. Slam and Salmon. I haven't seen that. I don't even know if I've heard of that. I know you've talked about them before. Yeah, and then their first one was called Puddle Cruiser. It's... Uh, it's fine. Puddle Cruiser? Yeah, they did that like when they were in college. What's that about? Uh, it's about this guy that's like trying to be on the rugby team or some shit. Yes. And Popeyes. I don't know. It, it's like a college like romance comedy. It's uh, like Ten Things I Hate About You. I don't know. Oh no, that I, was that was high school. Never mind. <laughs> I never saw that, and uh, that's not really my thing. So. I'll never see it. It's well, they parodied it a lot in a lot of other movies. Oh, you mean like not another teen movie? Yeah, like that's serious. It's like a straight copy. Oh, I keep doing that, like fall right down the. So you've seen not another teen movie, but you haven't seen uh, Ten Things I Hate About You. Nah, no, yeah. It's literally like what that movie came. They're like the same thing, except you know you don't have to look at Chris Evans whipped cream covered oh yeah i forgot that was chris evans <laughs> yeah his chris evans was in that man, another teen movie that's like captain america has america's ass and america's dick man that's crazy i forgot about that somebody i can't believe i haven't seen a picture on the internet where it shows like chris evans from not another teen movie alongside like the scene in the new marvel movie where it was like that's america's ass when it was captain america ah <laughs> oh, nice He's the one that played the main character in Snowpiercer, right? Yeah. Oh, and that's a fantastic movie. That's a great movie. Snowpiercer was one of the... Oh, I, I have it. I got the Blu-ray. They made it. a show out of it. They did? Yeah. What, is it on Netflix or... Um, I'm not... Sh- no, it's on like some like main cable. Uh, 
uh, channel. Oh, okay, that means I can't watch it. I mean, it might even be one of the I ones do that. The cable. What? Okay. This game looks impossible, and it doesn't look very fun. It's neither possible or fun. I wish we could find a good stopping point, but you just keep getting. I don't know if that's you don't. Yeah, I don't you, know if a good stopping point is gonna happen. I don't know if a good stopping point exists. So I can't believe it brings you all the way back to stage one. Well, so that's because we didn't save the game. I think. Oh yeah, you're right. But we'll know for next time when we play a different game because this is definitely not going to continue because it's really boring yeah it's boring and it's not even like fun to play because there's like no definition to the, like where you get hit or fuck yeah I believe uh and this then, isn't going to be one of the greatest Game Boy games we play and then a train will just come by randomly and hit you yeah but I, I gotta say props to you team who made this for pretty much including the entire story of the entire movie in just the beginning like I would never imagine a game like this to have that many cutscenes yeah to the point where I didn't know it was a game at first so it could have just been a port of a little Nikki onto the Game Boy <laughs> they, they did that with a few cartoons they had like a, episodes of like te Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and stuff you could put in a cartridge and watch them on your Game Boy really? yeah I, I, th I, don't, I think that was Game Boy Advance but I remember having one or two of those and it would be like three episodes on a cartridge and you just could watch oh, them oh wow yeah, so I know they did that with PSP where they had like specific games made movies. just for the or yeah that's what I mean movies Yeah. made just for the PSP which it's like uh, that's that's like a cash grab. Yeah. Half it, the time he just like literally starts running by himself. And why would you want to watch a movie? I mean, I guess that was before everybody had like tablets and stuff. So. You well, would, Dad's almost you dead. Watch it. Yeah. So. I think Dad is dead. He's just a hand. I don't know how much more dead you could be. So you're saying you're gonna give this one more try? And it, then dad's gonna die. Yeah, and I don't and really even see the point of giving it one more try. Oh, just, I just realized that's the same font as Godsmack. <laughs> the Godsmack logo. <laughs> oh, it is the same font yeah. as the Godsmack logo. <laughs> that just made playing this game worth it. Wow, it, like, once you get the fire power, it just, like, like boosts you directly forward. So you can't even... You can't count. You can't see what you're doing. It's too fast for you to even control. You just have to like jump and hope you don't hit something. Yeah, I think good old well, dad is about. Sorry, to be dead. dad. I fucked up. All right, let's see what happens to dad. You're dead. You're Game fucking dead. Game over, dad. Sorry, dad. Maybe next time. Six, six, six. Ubisoft. Dad is. Oh, I guess it just goes back to the beginning. Yeah, like yeah. completely to the beginning. Oh it yeah. It doesn't even show. Dad's disintegrated. Yep, he's done. You killed your dad. Well, he's dead. hopefully, uh... But Popeyes is awesome! It is. I do love me some Popeyes. Love that!